HIP is a joke. Lonnie McRae is disgusted with the plea agreements four of the 16s charged with her father's murder took Monday afternoon. They chose to go out and rob somebody that night. That was their intent, was to rob and obviously to murder because my father had nothing on him. Lonnie McRae is named after her father, Lonnie Bard. Last July, Bard was beaten to death on Stone Alley, just steps from his home. He was disabled and used a wheelchair. And I want to let you know that the system did fail you. McRae called out Brian Litton, Yassine Abdul Qadir, Joseph Foster, and Tyrone Cheatham. The four will be on home incarceration until they testify against another teen, Tavion Miley, next year. Litton, Foster, and Cheatham pleaded guilty to facilitation to commit murder and facilitation to commit robbery. Abdul Qadir entered an Alford plea, meaning he did not admit guilt to the same charges. They didn't talk about my father. Them kids don't even know why they was here today. Bard's family says their loved one was lost in the system. We lost the head, you know, the head of the family, the person who shows you how to walk through life. They say they'll use the rest of their lives to speak up for the man who can no longer speak for himself. And you wonder why our community is in the disarray that it's in. It's because there is no justice within the courts. Now, the Commonwealth's attorney declined to comment to reporters after today's hearing. Reporting live downtown, I'm Morgan Lentis, WLKY News. Thank you, Morgan. Another teenager, Markel Rice, is also expected to take a plea deal. He was not in court today. A hearing on his plea was scheduled for September.